it's always nice to snap a losing streak, even if it's one game. Uh, I was happy for those, the guys in the locker room because uh, I think they needed it. Uh, there's, there's, I'm looking, I'm really looking forward to, I'm happy we won. They should be happy they won. I'm looking forward to Monday because we got some things we're going to work on and get better. And I don't mean that badly. I mean that, that 13 offensive rebounds is too much. Uh, 57 points is a, is a good effort. Uh, we, we still having some major lulls in, in our offensive performance at times. You know, I thought we had great shots, but we just got to nail them. We got to nail them in those crunch times to keep that double digit lead. So uh, happy, but looking forward to getting better. What's it like just to see you guys rely on your defense um, play tough throughout the whole night on that end before? I thought it looked pretty good. And you know, of course the tape's gonna prove, prove us right or wrong. Uh, I, I, think, I, I think that you know, to hold a team like that, they've been scoring a lot of points. To hold a team like that to 57 is, is, is a good effort. I, I am disappointed with the 13 offensive rebounds. You guys have been looking for someone to step up scoring besides Kyle. What's it like just to see Brian he, the way he played? Tonight? That was probably one of the best things of the, of the game. You know, besides the 57 points, uh, I think that uh, having Brian step up and, you know, we, we ran a simple offense at the end because they were tr digging with the guy that entered the, the ball. So we were trying to just, it was our best offense going and throwing it into AJ and then having him pop it back out to Brian. And that got done. And Brian made three or four threes down the stretch there. And it was, it was really nice for, Brian and the team and the success of that offense. I mean, they've been bringing me through and telling me to keep confidence. It's going gonna, it's gonna to roll one day, and today it did. Uh, obviously, Kyle's been having a strong year, but it seems like you guys have just been looking for that another guy to kind of complement his scoring. Obviously, you seem like that kind of candidate. Do you kind of take it upon yourself to kind of be that number two option? Yeah, I, I mean, me and Coach have talked about that. Uh, with Tommy out now, we lose a lot of scoring there. and. I mean, I do have to keep, take it on myself to be the one to, to be driving just like Kyle does. And if it's there, score. If it's not, kick it to the open shooters and, and create for, for the team. Uh, that's huge for us. I know last season we started the preseason conference play at 2-4. and four. This year we were hoping for a lot better. We had that 2-0 and oh start, like you said. But for us getting those three straight losses, that, that hurts us, especially one being in overtime. And then a couple that I thought it was really our fault that we lost it. Getting back on track right before conference play is huge for us. Started one for five, slow start, but it just seemed those misses, did they seem like good looks for you and they were just kind of bound? Oh uh, yeah, I definitely, I mean, those are the same shots I've been shooting these last couple games and they've been falling then. I don't think any of them were really bad looks per se. I just, like you said, I just think they weren't falling as much tonight and it's nice that we had everyone there to pick me up and make sure that our offense kept rolling. You've had to shoulder a lot of the scoring so far this season. What's it like to see Brian come through tonight? Uh, it's, I mean, it's great. We, I think our team has plenty of capable scorers that any night can go off like Brian did tonight. And I think that as the season goes on, we're going to need more and more of that just so teams have to play everyone honestly. Tonight, I think overall, we all shot pretty well. And as a defense, it's very tough to guard five guys out there without doubling anyone or playing any sort of different defense, it's, it's really tough to guard. The game where there were scoring droughts for you guys, but what's it like to kind of rely on your defense tonight to get the win and hold the 55 points? Uh, I think that's something that we should be able to rely on week in, week out. After the first 10 minutes or so of the game, we let up 20 points, which is way too much for us. After that, though, I think 35 points in 30 minutes is a pretty good thing. If we can stay at that pace, we're going to be a pretty tough team to beat.